Hi guys, have you ever felt like you're talking to a robot when you use ChatGPT? Like you're pouring your heart out and all it's giving you is generic responses? Well, I know how it feels. But don't worry, I'm here to help you make the most out of a robotic friend. So welcome to my video on how to use ChatGPT correctly, or as I like to call it, how to train your robot. You see, using ChatGPT is a lot like training a pet. Except, instead of giving it treats, you give it prompts. And instead of wagging its tail, it gives you a response. So the bottom line is, the better prompts you give, the better response you get. So in our video, we're going to be looking at how to give the right prompts to get the best possible results from ChatGPT. And not just that, I'll show you some tools and extensions that lets you use ChatGPT in different ways. And it's going to save your day. So without much delay, let's get started. Now you might be thinking, if ChatGPT is so smart, why can't it generate high quality content on its own? The truth is, ChatGPT is only as good as the prompts that you give it. If you give it a vague or poorly written prompt, it won't generate a high quality content. But if you give it a clear and well structured prompt, you will be amazed at the quality of content it can produce. Let me give you an example. Say you want to write an article about the benefits of meditation. So if you give ChatGPT a prompt like, write an article about meditation, you're going to get something like this, which is just a bunch of information. But if you give it a more specific prompt like this one, where I've asked it to write an in-depth article with some positive effects of meditation and also add some practical tips, you can see that we've got a much better results with proper headings, good outline and a well-structured article. Impressive, right? Now, instead of creating the prompts by yourself, you can check out websites on the internet that has pre-written forms for almost all the requirements that you may have. So I browsed through and found some cool websites. Here's an example. Here you can get prompts for any topic like marketing, business, web development, etc. All you need to do is go to the category you want and you can see different prompts. Just copy the one you want, paste it on ChatGPT and you can fill the space with your requirement. And that's all. Your perfect result is ready. Now there are many websites like this and I found some very interesting prompts too. Check this out. There are prompts that make ChatGPT act like an English teacher, be your psychologist, your personal trainer, and anyone. And trust me, it does a really good job. So let me know in the comment sections below which one you like the most. Alright guys, now if you don't want to go through all the websites and find the prompts you want, there's a Chrome extension that works directly on ChatGPT, that is AIPRM. I've given a link in the description so you can add it and once you do that, your ChatGPT screen will look like this. You'll get different types of prompts here. Now, you'll get these new options where you can set the writing style, the tone for the output that you want to get. Now, here you can search for any type of content you want to create, or you can also select any topic here. Say you want to create an SEO optimized article. You can select this, and that's all. Now, you just have to enter the keywords for your article. And there you go, we've got the content. Now, if we compare this content with the result from a normal prompt, you can see this is much better. Okay, so guys, now you have an idea of how to get better results with the right prompts. Next, let's look at some more Chrome extensions that can help you get the most out of ChatGPT. One such extension is ChatGPT Writer. This one helps you write emails quickly and more effectively. Let's see how it works. Just add the extension. Now, if you go to Gmail and compose a mail, you can see here, we have the icon of the extension. So just click on it. And here, enter what your mail is about. Now, if you click generate, the content for your email will be ready. And if you click here, it will be added to your email. It's that easy. Now, more interestingly, with this extension, you can also reply to any email. So let's try it out. Let's open an email here and click reply. Now, if we click on this icon, you can see it has automatically read the content of the previous email and if you just enter what you want to reply and click here, your perfect reply will be ready. Amazing, right? Okay, let's go to the next extension, which is ChatGPT for Google. Yes, as the name says, with this extension, you can use ChatGPT on Google. So just add it. Now, if you go to Google and search for something, you can see along with the search results, we're also getting the ChatGPT response for the search. Now, this will be helpful for people who constantly use ChatGPT. So, instead of opening a separate tab 
they can just go to Google and search for what they want. And now it's bonus time. Now instead of creating the prompts by yourself, you can make ChatGPT create the prompt for you. I'm not kidding. I found this prompt on the internet and if you use it on ChatGPT, it'll ask you the questions to understand what you're looking for and it'll create you the perfect prompt for your requirement. So let's try that out. Now here you can see it is asking us what our prompt should be about. So I'm going to create a prompt for the same meditation article we created. So I'm going to enter that and it asks you for more questions. This time it asked me what my article is about and who are the target audience. Let me enter that here and it's going to keep asking you for more information to give you a detailed prompt. So you can enter all the details you want here. And as you can see, it has generated a long prompt. So let's see what kind of result we can get from this prompt. Just copy this, go to a new chat and paste it here. Hmm, we got a very detailed and a comprehensive article. The best part is it gave us the content according to our needs and not just a generic one. So I've given the prompt to generate prompts in the description. Okay, so that's about it guys. I hope this video was helpful for you and I've added the links to all the websites and extensions we saw today. Do check them out and leave a comment if you like them. Now, if you're specifically looking to create blog posts, there's an amazing AI tool called Gravity Write which helps you create top-notch content. If you want to know more about it, check out this video. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.